See Daenerys. Can't wait for that. Big day tomorrow, isn't it? Off to Craster's Keep. Assuming you're not too busy looking for your North Grove. I thought you didn't believe in it. Not saying I do. But if it was real, can you trust Cotter with it? You ask me. Is there something off about him? Aside from him being an oily thief, I mean. Not like he's holding something back. Wouldn't hurt to keep an eye on him. Don't need to tell me that. He steals my knife, then your stuff. I'm not sure I want him walking behind me while we're out there. Finn! Get back on watch until your relief arrives. They're late. You think Mance Raider is going to wait for them? Right. Asshole. And Tuttle, you've got torches that have gone out. Keep them lit. Let the wildlings know we're still home. Uncle Duncan brought these from Ironrath. Wonder if I'll ever see it again. That's Ironwood for sure. If anyone tries coming over the wall, well, those will stop them. These torches. It'll be here soon. Wonder who's riding it. I miss any torches. This must hold up the lift. It'd probably fall apart if it wasn't frozen together. Solid ice. This won't be melting anytime soon. mile wall, and you're still in my way. I figured we'd settle things on the way to Crasters, but this is even better. Jon Snow can't hold your hand now. The wall's a dangerous place. People slip off all the time. Still have some fighting spirit left in you, huh? I did duty to my lord back on that bloody farm. If for doing a proper job of it, what I get? Banished to the fucking wall! I never did tell you about your father, did I? We bled him at first. Like a pig. Seemed only fair he should feel what it's like. Near the end, he could barely breathe. Kept begging us to leave your sister alone. So I made sure he was still alive when she started screaming. It was the last thing your father ever heard. The more we I'm sliced, yourself. the worse it got. Shrieking the whole time. Her crying out. Get You're not worth it. I didn't come here to chat, you fucking cunt. <laughs> Too bad your father didn't fight like that. Might still be alive. And I thought you were going to make this easy. Finally getting the hang of it, Tuttle. Stop, damn it! I don't want to fight you! What's the matter? 
Don't you want to make your father proud? Let's see if you scream like your sister. You got lucky, pig farmer. You're going to slaughter me. Like my man back at your farm. At least let me have my sword. Keep it interesting. Or are you afraid? I swore my vows. I won't kill a brother. You're fucking pathetic, Tuttle. Fucking finish it. Go on. We're done here. I tried to stop. He, I mean, I was defending myself. What do you want me to do? Die? My lord. I mean, I guess. Our people are starving and afraid. The White Hills have driven them away from the ironwood groves. Out of the way! To make matters worse, your brother Ethan had me collect provisions from the small folk. And so they come to us, looking for food. Food we don't have to spare. How can we support an army and retain our position in the north if we can't even feed the people we see before us? It's like the dead of winter's come. And it doesn't look like it's getting better. No one has more fight in them than Asher. I'm sure he and Malcolm will find us the army we need. Well, I hope we can figure something out. As long as the White Hills are in our house, we have to be careful. Come on, you! Let me go! You can't do this! Good. Uh, You're here. Uh, Look. Look at this! Uh, did you see what this girl did? She attacked my man like an animal! Bloody bit me! Yeah, now it's her turn! Uh, She's gonna get what she has coming to her. This won't go unpunished. Let go of me! I don't care if she's your sister. Fine. You've brought her to me. I'll deal with her. That's not for you to decide. I saw him stealing from our kitchen, and I told him to stop. He laid his hands on me, so I bit him. You bloody wench! I was only doing what had to be done. I warned you not to mistreat my men. Someone will have to answer for this. Do you hear me? Don't make this ugly. We've done enough for you. You can't push us any further. I can push you as much as I like. And if your people don't see that, they need to learn their place. This girl is out of control. Don't listen to him, Roderick. And if you can't rein her in, yeah, what about the rest of them? It's about time she saw a real lord again and learned proper discipline. They've all been missing that. My sister, she made a mistake. That's all. 
She is but a child, and this arrangement tests us all. I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. She's not the only one who's made mistakes. And the problem starts at the top, Roderick. Careful, boy. You yourself had the gall to make threats against my men. And that's the real problem with you foresters. You're too fucking proud. Always have been. It was bad enough when you were above us. And now it's even worse. Because you don't see how far you've fallen! Still high enough to look down at you. Wait. Forgive her. Forgive her. The passions of youth. No one questions your authority, Griff. You have the power. Oh, I like him. You thought this was your man, Roderick? He's mine. A dog to be sure, but my dog. That's how I like to see you, Foresters. Obedient servants! He's a loyal member of my house. A man of peace. And he deserves to be treated as such. You don't get it, do you? You foresters need to learn when you're beaten. <laughs> you will learn some fucking humility. Or oh, this won't be the last lesson I teach you foresters! Have you no honour? I'll run you through for that. I'll cut you down like straw men. Stand down, Royland. As you wish. <clears throat> I bet this makes you angry, eh? You probably want to get up and hit me. But we know how that would go, don't we? Now, are you going to be a good little forester, learn your lesson, and stay down? Roderick! I said, get down! All the way down. Get up, Roderick! Stay down, my lord. Your brother defied Ramsay Snow. He didn't know his place, but we made damn sure he learned. I'll probably have to teach Talia here. Unless you're a good little forester. You learn your place, and stay down. Some forester is gonna learn their lesson today. You don't have to do that, Lord Griff. Will it be you? Or will it be... Oh, I'll stay down. <laughs> Consider this evening, girl. Your brother learned the lesson for you. You'd be wise to follow his lead. As would all of you. Your lord is a smart man. First in his line that understands. Now you need to understand too. You can be lord, Roderick. So long as we all know who holds the reins here. Come on. You did the right thing, my son. You had to submit. Aye. A true lord. But we... We let them win. <laughs> There's a time to fight. It's not now. That's all. I'm not gonna fight. There's gonna be a good plan for this. I, I trust in you Game of Thrones. Telltale games, whatever. Do you see that? He still acts like he rules the house. But he's let his guard down. So, did he get what he wanted? Or did you? At the time, I... I wanted you to crush him. I'm just glad you're still alive. Now is not the time to fight. Well, exactly. That time is cold. That's what he wants. That's, that's what he should won't. be saying. He won't be ready when it does. And when you're better, things will be different. You get it now. 
I asked Ethan not to change who he was. He promised he wouldn't, and look what happened. I now know that was childish of me. I'm ready to change now. I'm willing to do anything to help our family. I mean it, Roderick. I don't care what. I'll do it. I am too. Father used to say we foresters are as tough as the ironwood. We are. All of us. And I'm sure the others will do whatever it takes as well. In due time. What you did, yielding to Griff, you had your reasons. But... No one can know the future. Whatever tomorrow brings, Talia, the foresters will stand tall. We did it. I can't believe it. What are you waiting for? There's no good that can come from this. Not anymore. And that's a hard decision. I, I gotta burn it. The Khaleesi will see you now. So, Asher Forrester, if you presume to speak of my dragons, choose your words carefully. Good shot. Next time on Game of Thrones. What have you done, Garrett? Frostfinger is calling for your head. Tell me Brit's death was an accident. Was... Mira, what are you doing? I can't pretend I haven't seen this. Mira, just tell me what's going on. We are weak. We have no allies. And Griff claims to be the new Lord of Ironrath. There's been a raven from Lord Whitehill. He's invited us to High Point. Drogon wouldn't have attacked without reason. By order of the Queen! I... Fuck you and your Queen. Deal with your friend. Nothing ever stays in the past, Asha. Carried. <laughs> it's time to go. Forty nine percent saved Malcolm, forty eight percent defied Marjorie and spoke to Tyrion, sixty eight point nine percent walked away from Brit, sixty seven percent submitted to Griff Whitehill. See that's a that's the, those are the smart choices. Only twenty nine percent burned oh shit. Well, that's probably gonna bite me in the ass, huh? That was Game of Thrones episode three, Telltale Games. Crazy game so far. I'm excited to see what the next episode is. Um, and if you're new to the channel, I would uh, hope that you could subscribe to my channel. You know, like, share, whatever it is. Uh, and I hope you enjoyed it because that's my goal. Making sure everyone's entertained. Um, more videos to come, that's for sure. And again, I, I stream a lot on my Twitch uh, and my uh, on YouTube as well. So just make sure if you subscribe, hit that bell button and you'll get notified about it all right take care have a good day night whatever it is that it that you uh watched this video at oh god i can't talk anyways take care bye bye